know what I, <laughs> Elvis used to love to sing uh, late at night, you know, in, in Vegas after we do the shows, we would go to his suite and we would sing gospel songs. And he was... Um, so he that, no, look at that, eh? So, so you used to, used to sit together and sing together? Yeah, so he was... Uh, he didn't realise that we sang gospel songs in Wales, because I knew a lot of the songs that we were... Yeah, because his idea, because he was, you know, obviously he was in the South that he was born and brought up. What did he think of the UK? What do you think of Wales? What was his idea of what Wales well, was like? he was like? asking me about it. What, uh, what was it like? And do people sing like I sing in Wales? And I said, well, they have big voices, but uh, it's more traditional. The, the singing is more uh, traditional there. Uh, did, did he ever talk about whether, why, why he never came here, why he performed here? I guess that was Colonel Tom's thinking. But did he ever express an interest in coming to sing for his fans in the UK? Yeah, he wanted to. And he was asking me what, it, what I thought it would be like for him to come in. I said, you're Elvis Presley, for God's sake. I mean, uh, you know, they'd, they'd love you to come to Britain. And he said, well, if I come there, will you, will you show me around? And I said, well, I, I don't think I'll have to, but I will if, you, if you'd like. <laughs> uh, but you guys, you, you, you always struck me as being uh, similar performers in some way. You know, very masculine on stage, very mm. kind of earthy and powerful. And also, the outfit you wore, you both went through similar phases where you had uh, more 60s outfits, then you both went into the leather period as well, and yep. you got more showy. Did you go shopping together? Did you buy clothes together? No, but we used, we used to get stuff from this place in, in Los Angeles called North Beach Leather. They used to make this leather stuff, and, and 